60 years ago, the Queen's coronation was broadcast. A 26-year-old princess embarking on a lifetime of service. For six decades, she has put duty first. 60 years later, it's a different world. Her grandson was infamously caught on camera, pictured on a cell phone. Harry describing in an interview the challenges of a world where everyone has a camera. I don't believe there is any such thing as private life anymore. I'm not going to sit here and whinge. Um, everyone knows about Twitter and the internet and stuff like that. Um, every single uh, mobile phone has got a camera on it now. You can't move an inch without someone judging you. Um, and, you know, that's, I suppose that's just the way life goes. Even the interview itself, a sign of how the world has changed for the royals. Recorded during filming as Harry served in the Royal Air Force in Afghanistan. The Queen has never given an interview. And while the young royals are still royal, the international tours, the adoring crowds, the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge and their younger brother's celebrity around the world has brought new pressures. Diana experienced it, of course, chased by paparazzi, just as Kate would be decades later, an experience that has William determined to prevent the same treatment for his wife, suing the photographer who took those now infamous topless pictures of Kate in France. It harks back to the days of Diana. They feel that she was hounded. They feel that the paparazzi was partly responsible for her death in Paris. And let's not forget, they were little boys on family holidays and constantly being photographed. It annoyed their mother, it upset her, it reduced her to tears. They remember all that. Hey, hey, hey. But for the royals, the media are now part of their lives. And as William and Kate prepare to bring a new life into the world, there will be a clamour for news. I get the impression that the Duchess of Cambridge, a keen amateur photographer, a new mum is going to be wanting to be proudly displaying this baby. But will William be pulling her back in that? As the Queen celebrates the anniversary of her coronation, she has reason to smile at the success of her grandchildren and could be forgiven for worrying about the pressures that the modern world puts on her royal family. Keir Simmons, NBC News, London.